Pursuing the Dream with Habitat for Humanity of Orange County. I've been myself, you know, in a very hard situation. Single mom with five children, raising all by my own, and uh, sleeping in a tiny, tiny living room, sleeping on the floor. And, and we, you know, like, a, it looked like El Campo de Pancho Villa. I was divorced, three small children, working full time, one child ill, that you're running to the doctors and having surgeries and stuff all the time. We're living in, um, in an apartment. We're moving like every year, six months from home to home. And it was, um, it was kind of hard on our children. I was concerned. Um, I had no college education. I'm working hard. And how do you support these children and give them stability? In the last place that we used to live, the carpet was really old. And also the paint was kind of old. It had it asbestos. And since we have our children that have cystic fibrosis, and my other two kids have uh, mild asthma, it was hard for them because of the allergens. It was scary and sad because it's not what you plan for your life. And um, you love your children with all your heart and you want to give them the best you can. And you know, my best at that point really wasn't enough. I was working um, two jobs um, as a security guard and work, I worked at a, in a flower shop at a mortuary. I was like a sinking, more than I move, more than I sing, but there is the helping hands and I don't have a word to express the gratitude. The over to the past of the years, I'm still so grateful to them. Building the Dream with Habitat for Humanity of Orange County. I was in the licensed vocational program nurse and I just uh, finished taking a test. And then I received a call that um, someone is going to come to our house. And I was thinking, well, is maybe another interview. They came and they brought some flowers and they told us that we got the house and everyone started crying. Guy, screaming. <laughs> <laughs> it was just a normal crazy evening in my household. <laughs> Long day at work and <laughs> three little kids get their homework done and bath, get them fed. And um, I got the phone call. I would say, and so it kind of makes me want to cry. In some type of ways, it was a relief. It was like 9.30 in the night. And, and I opened the door and I see, you know, uh, I remember his name, Ronald, from the register. He has the cameras and, and a hammer in his hand. And he says, who's Irma Garcia? I says, me. And he gave me the hammer like that. I said, yes, I was jumping full of joy. It was exciting building together, too, with all the other families. You built a bond and a reality. You know, there's other people that needed the same help you needed. Even though um, I was so tired, I keep going. And it doesn't matter if it was hot, I keep going because it was my house. So I had to build it. And you just can't help but be grateful. You know, every time we were out here working on it, it's the love from other people is what built this. And it's pretty overwhelming. To go to work uh, every weekend, but you don't feel tired, you feel happy because you're building your future there. Living the Dream with Habitat for Humanity of Orange County. Habitat for Humanity of Orange County know the reality of some of the struggles that families deal with. They want to do the best for their family and to be able to do it proudly. It was a blessing for us to finally call us somewhere where we could say it's our home. I was making very little money, so, you know, like uh, I was able to encourage my kids and help them out. When we move over here to this house, we found a stability. As a family, now we talk about like, oh, when you go to college, university, and they feel secure, they don't have to um, be worrying where we're going to be in three years. It's, you know, a hand up, not a hand out. And um, that was what I needed in my life at that time. 
also, and that's what my children needed. And they all graduate, they go to the military service, they go to college, and they get married, they have children by their own. And then I'm a living proof of what Habitat can do for families like me. This gave my children a very strong, solid foundation to build on. This is our home and our memories, and Habitat gave that to us. And um, that's something too big to put in words. Yeah, too big to put in words. And I'm super happy and I feel like a queen in a castle. I'm so thankful because without you guys, our family wouldn't have a home. I would like to thank um, Habitat for Humanity of Orange County for being here for their families to um, become successful in life and give their children hope. It's a need that'll never go away because there's always going to be someone struggling. And I just hope and pray that Habitat will always be there for them. And it's a beautiful thing.